Okay, I'm going to demonstrate how to uh, program and mess with the stock Epiphany board. This can also work for stock Ion boards, uh, stock Ion XE, stock EOS, whatever. Um, first off, what you should probably do is grab a manual or download a version of it because it will help you. And then uh, to change, I'm going to show you how to change modes because I've had people asking me several times now. I'll just make a video and they can refer to that and it's even showing them instead of me talking about it but uh... what you need to do is you can just open your grips I have my gun taken apart from another video but uh... you open your grips up here and you make sure you have a uh, battery and everything in there alright I'm gonna go through the uh... what you'll encounter in programming mode here in a minute All right. setting number one is the first setting you go through it's a solid yellow light um, it's dwell up that means if you need to have your dwell go uh, say from 30 to 40 you put on there and you hit it 10 times of course the next one is a solid red it's dwell down so you need to lower your dwell if you install QEV or something or if you're just using too much air in your shots um, you go to that and lower it that way next one is ROF delay up Alright, if you want your gun to shoot faster, you do not want to go to ROF delay up. That's rate of fire delay. That means you're going to, it's going to be slowing your gun down. If you're putting that up, it means it's slowing your gun down even more. It even says shoot slower. And that'll blink yellow. Just a s slow blink. You'll see in a minute. If you want your gun to shoot faster, you need to go to ROF delay down. That's uh, blinking red. And if you want to shoot the cap 17 BPS on the board, you have to go to that and just keep hitting it hitting the button until it doesn't go any lower. Next is firing modes up. Alright, if you want to change from semi-auto to something, which semi-auto is the stock setting, you need to go to that, and I'll talk more about that in a minute. And you can cycle between rebound, three round burst, and full auto. And next is uh, double blink red, which is firing modes down. Say you're on full auto, you want to get back on semi, you get on that, or you want to get back on three round burst, or uh, rebound whatever you just hop on that and use that all right what you need to do is take the uh, screws off your grip here and open it up see if you can see it there my hands sort of shaky because I'm tired but uh, there's a little gray button that's what you're going to use first off you want to turn your gun on see the lights on it's flashing then you want to hit this little button here see how it's solid yellow that's the uh, dwell up hit it again solid red that's dwell down all right uh, Next one, blinking yellow, that's rate of fire delay up, you don't want that. You have to go to this blinking style, it's blink, 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 alright. Um, if you want your gun to shoot faster, what you need to do is hit the power button. Alright, you see mine, it's not doing anything. It's not flashing anything, because whenever you change modes, it'll flash yellow up here if it's red, and if it's yellow, it'll flash red. Um, to indicate that it's as high as or as low as you can get it. See, it's not doing anything. To save it, all you gotta do is hit trigger, save. The gun goes back to normal. You wanna be careful not to have this gas oven pointing it at friends when you have it a loader on top too, because you can end up shooting them. All right. Now we're back here. We're down here to the double blinking yellow. That's firing modes up. Right now, I have it set on semi-auto and people want to go to rebound what you need to do is hit the power button flashes alright now you're on mode 2 now all you gotta do is save it next mode 3 round burst alright next one full auto see after you reach full auto see how when I hit it it's not flashing that means you're as high as you can get now to go back down you gotta put on double blinking red then you just hit it now I'm on 3 round burst rebound semi see when I hit it it doesn't flash anything else besides the red and there you go, you have it programmed to whatever mode or setting that you need it to. After that, you just tap the trigger, it's saved, and uh, you go out and play. It's pretty simple. I think it's, and some people can be kind of strange, but uh, that's how you program the stock board and mess with it. Um, if you have any other questions to ask, I'll be more than happy to answer. There you go.